Protect your privacy online with the best VPN for gaming, ExpressVPN. And visit expressvpn.com slash gillymaster, linked in the description, to find out how you can get three months free. Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of the GT Online Top 5 Community Plays. If you're new to the channel, this is a series where I take clips from you guys, the community, and pick five of the best ones to showcase each week. And if that interests you and you'd like to send in a clip of your own, all the instructions to do so can be found down below in the description. Starting us off today at number 5, we have Nath the Tronza who takes on a laser with a mogul and comes out victorious. There were definitely a few close calls in there where the laser almost got him with the cannons, but being close doesn't cut it in a dogfight. And for some reason, the jet decides to fly away, which only gives the advantage to the mogul. If the jet had just kept going in circles with it, the mogul never would have a chance because its turn radius is terrible. And for that mistake, he gets shot straight out of the jet by the very powerful mogul front gun. At number 4 is Low Mine 7895 with a very unexpected way of taking out a jet. From the start of this clip, it almost looks exactly like the Trader takedown that happened last week where the car flew over the jet and hit it with missiles. In this case, the jet dodged the missiles but got body slammed by the car on its way down. And I don't even know if the jet saw the car before it hit him because he was preoccupied with dodging the incoming missiles before he got hit. But I feel like in third person, he should have been able to see him unless he was using like the close-up camera angle. Either way, it's just a really funny situation. At number 3 is CNY Pays in an Akula, and he's trying to use the Barrage missiles to take out an Oppressor Mark II. That was good on him for even being able to track the Mark II oppressor in the air below him because even I had a hard time seeing it watching the clip, it's just so small. And the barrage on the Akula only shoots 4 missiles so the odds of hitting the oppressor with one are very low considering its size, but not impossible as the final missile from the barrage just nails him and just in time too because the missiles are starting to come in from the oppressor and luckily he gets out of there only taking one rocket. In the number 2 spot is JDM Ejera with a godly play while flying upside down. Look how far he shot that free aim rocket to hit that jet, all while controlling the Mark II upside down. That's impressive. It's not something that you're going to see your average 5 IQ presser player pull off because that's not easy to do at all. Even trying to control the Mark II presser to get it where you want to go upside down is a task in itself. But being able to angle a shot like that right below you on a jet and hit it, that's, that's crazy. And at the number one spot this week is Archie X-Pac with some sweet, sweet revenge. He gets taken out by the meme cannon laser just one time and then does some Einstein level calculations before firing the RPG in hopes that the jet flies into it, and it does. And the crazy part about this is that he doesn't really know how high the jet is because he doesn't have a line of sight on it but when he fires it, so so much had to go right for him in order for this to work out, and it's so awesome that it did. Now is it somewhat lucky? Yeah of course it is, but some of the coolest clips to watch are based on luck and doesn't mean that it's a bad thing. 
Anyways, that is going to wrap up this episode of the GT Online Top 5 Community Plays. Again, if you are interested in submitting a clip for a chance to be featured in the next episode, all you have to do is follow the instructions that I have down below in the description. And if you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like as well as subscribe to my channel for more guide and PvP related content. Let me know which clip is your favorite in the comments. Huge thank you to all my channel members for your support. If you'd like to become a member for some exclusive perks, you can either use the join button or the link that's down in the description. And as always, thanks for watching and have a great day.